Hi everyone, this is Adam Zeiss for CrackBerry.com. We're going to take a quick look at using bedside mode on your BlackBerry smartphone. Bedside mode is a feature, it wasn't available in early versions of the OS, but it's actually an excellent feature, one that I personally love, probably use the most um, unknowingly in a way um, of all the features on the BlackBerry. So we go ahead and jump into the clock application. We'll see here the clock pops up obviously. Um, and we have a couple options to set the time, which should be set by the network already. You have your alarm options, um, so you can set your alarm for weekdays, on, off, set the time, all that good stuff. Um, and then we see we have the option to enter bedside mode automatically, but we're going to go ahead and set that up first. So we jump into the options, and we have all your clock options. You can change the display. I personally like the flip clock. We also have the standard analog. There's a digital and an LCD digital. Um, and here we have the option when charging, this means when it's plugged in, it could be USB or just through a, a wall charger or the charging pod like we have here. Um, you can do nothing, display the clock or enter bedside mode. Do nothing just means it's going to be plugged in and charging, it'll just keep all the settings that you have set normally. Display clock will keep the same settings as far as profile, LED, all that good stuff and it'll just show the clock on the screen. And then we have enter bedside mode, which is what we're going to leave it at here and we'll scroll down and set up that. Here you have your alarm settings um, so if you want to use the alarm at the clock you can choose any uh, ringtone that you have on the device. You can set the snooze time so this is how long the alarm will stay off before it rings again when you hit the snooze button um, volume and vibration and then you have to try it there to test it out. We'll go ahead down to the bedside mode options. Uh, the first option we have here is disable LED. You have yes or no. This when set to yes, it'll turn off your uh, LED light, and so any notifications that you have coming in where the LED would normally flash for your standard profile, it's going to be disabled. So that's good when you're sleeping, so you won't be constantly rolling over at 3 o'clock in the morning and seeing the LED flash and wanting to check your device. So that works out well in that case. Uh, then we have the disable radio here. We have the options for yes or no. When this is set to yes, it'll turn off uh, the radio on the device. So you won't have any data coming in, so you won't get any emails, BlackBerry Messenger, anything like that. I leave that to no because I like to have everything come in at night. Um, and then we have the dim screen. You can set that to yes or no. If you leave it on no, it's going to keep your BlackBerry at the standard brightness, whatever you have it set at. I like to put it to yes. It puts it down to uh, a very dimmer display, so it's not annoying in the middle of the night. And then we have the sound profile here. You can have it set any sound profile when it enters bedside mode. I go with the phone calls only where I only have uh, phone calls and SMS alerts. You can create a custom bedside mode alert um, if you have certain alerts that you want when you're in bedside mode or anything like that or you can choose to just have all alerts shut off. Um, so once we set our bedside mode options, <clears throat> and we can go ahead and save. And then you can see we're in our normal profile right now. We have data on, um, all that good stuff. So I use my uh, charging pod on my nightstand. We go ahead and throw the device in there. And we see it's going to enter bedside mode. It slipped out a little bit there. It wasn't in the charger, right? Um, and then the clock's going to display. So this is going to take on all the settings. We see the screen dims. And uh, my LED is not going to alert if anything comes in. I do have my sound profiles active, but it goes down to a dim screen. So I leave this on my nightstand, uh, use it as my clock. You can set your alarm here as well. So this is great when you throw it in the charger, it, it'll automatically enter bedside mode. When you pull it out, it's going to go right back to whatever your profile was set out before. And if you throw it in, um, if you're just charging at your desk or in the car or something like that, you can hit clear. We see we have the option to exit bedside mode. You hit OK, and it'll pull it right back out. You can see it's still charging, but it just returns back to the normal profile. Um, so bedside mode is great if you use your device as an alarm clock or you just want to have a quick way to tweak your settings so there's no alerts going off while you're asleep or anything like that. And that's really all there is to it. That is bedside mode for BlackBerry smartphones.